as quilters, we often want to commemorate special occasions, and we can draw a lot of inspiration from heirloom sewing. I love heirloom projects. The, this little pillow and the, the little garment is so sweet. You know, so many people do heirloom sewing, like this little garment um, with the laces here in the skirt. But to take it into the quilting part, this pillow, I have simply joined laces together to create these setting triangles. So, And it creates a block. You could just repeat that into sure. a full quilt. Today I'm going to show you how simple it is to join lace to lace with the right foot on your machine, of course. Of course. <laughs> Before we even go over to the machine, it's important that you use the right kind of lace. This is a cotton lace, it is an heirloom lace. Make sure that you um, invest in the, in the good The quality laces. laces. Yes. Mm -hmm. I'm going to use foot number 10, which we call the edge stitching foot. Um, it has a guide in the center, so I will place a piece of lace on either side of the guide and it magically draws those pieces of lace together and I can zigzag over the top. And it keeps them from overlapping. Correct. And the foot just magically draws them in. I'm going to place the lace under the foot, one on either side of the guide, and zigzag them together. Well, that looks easy enough. <laughs> it's very easy. Normally, I would be using a 60 weight white thread and a size 60 needle. I have black in my machine just so that you can actually see the stitching because when you do this the stitching just seems to blend into that lace and you don't see stitching. I've set my zigzag stitch at a one length and I start out at a two width but what I really want to do is to make sure that my zigzag stitch covers the heading on both sides of the lace so I may have to adjust that zigzag stitch. So you would just keep joining rows of lace until you have enough to create your triangles or your insertion. Correct. On this, I joined enough pieces of lace to make a square. And then you and cut it. And then I cut the square, mm -hmm. just like traditional mm -hmm. quilting mm -hmm. methods. For this and other heirloom techniques, visit your local Bernina dealer today. Mm -hmm.